Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to another episode of Minecraft CTM map Dawn of Shadow. Last time we took on the gray wool, light gray, and brown wool all in one episode and we got all three of them. Uh, sorry I wasn't able to record yesterday because I had a project that I needed to work on and the little time I had for Minecraft left I actually used to build this little railroad right over here. Yeah, this rail leads all the way, all the way over there, as you can see. Uh, goes all the way back to intersection two, which is pretty freaking useful. Uh, but today, we're going to continue to truck on forward. Third intersection, we're going to go into the Minefell Ravine, 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 however you want to call it first. Uh, off camera, I just, I also did a little bit of lighting in this area just because. Um, just because there's still like a little bit of mobs coming and I also saw like down there there's actually some uh, some wool so uh, that'll be pretty freaking useful I'd say I don't have any boots so I like I need I need some fucking iron ASAP Um, make sure, yeah, as you can see, there's a wall down there and then there's something over there. I think that's a loot box of some sort. I see, I'm not sure if that's iron or gold. I think that's gold. So the gold block is right there. Uh, but I don't see any clear way to actually go down there. I don't see anything. So, um, okay. Y'all want to relax a little bit? <sighs> Wait, actually, what the hell is that? Did you see that? There's some... Okay, yeah, there's some... There's a torch down there for some reason. Huh. Wonder what that's all about. So I guess we're supposed to go over here? I was going to go bridge across to see if there's any wolves over there, but... I, I guess I guess not? Um, where's that skelly? There you go. Just get rid of that guy once and for all. That is void. And I think that's a... I think that's a blaze spawner? Okay. Seems we have a whole bunch of iron here. Which is really good. Uh, finally found some more iron. It's about goddamn time. So now I can go ahead and mine some of this and then get me some get me some proper iron gear. Uh, but first I want to check out what's over here because this is torched up so there's probably something important. Okay, I see some light. Wait, what? This is the wool. Wait, so I saw another wool outside. What was all that about? the hell is this um is this like a dummy wool or is he i feel like this is a dummy wool this what okay um purple wool achieved <laughs> i don't know what, what the hell was that we just we just beat the purple wool in like two minutes um, okay, I mean, I, I'll take it, I'll take it any day, uh, and we have a good ample supply of iron here that I'm definitely going to be mining in the future. Okay, I hear a skelly. Yeah, I'm being super careful because I hear skellies right now. Okay, I just don't, I don't want them to knock me off because if I fall off here, 
I'm going to get stuck in the void and then I'll die. Okay, if I, if I can make a stairway here, this will actually be really good. This is making me so paranoid right now. Holy. Okay, if I, I shouldn't get knocked off anymore. Or I shouldn't be at risk of it. Yeah, I need to light this place up. Too many mobs over here. Huh. <sighs> oh, we got an iron ingot. That's good. Oh, this is just efficiency. Uh, this thing is broken because I was using a few efficiency one picks when I was building my railroad and I happened to uh, finish it with some really damaged items so I just combined them into an efficiency toothpick. So that's why this thing is almost broken. But, um, okay, this looks pretty secure now, I'd say. Uh, oh, we got two iron ingots now. Huh, huh. Okay. Well, we got the purple wool, we found some more iron, things are looking pretty good for us so far. Um, now it's a question of how do I get down there, because there's another wool over there and there's this item. Not sure exactly what this item holds. Okay, why do I hear more of these guys? This should not be happening. Okay, um, I guess, let's see if we can scale down somehow. Okay, we have some solid ground over there. If we can go over there, we'll be good to go. Actually, our pickaxe is almost dead, so there's, we probably don't want to do that yet. But I will go ahead and mine a whole bunch of this, right? Get some more iron going for us. Uh, so let's see, how, did, how exactly do I get back up from here? I can go this way, I think. Let me put that there. And then I can do this, that, um, actually. There we go, do this, and then climb up like that, and then we're good to go, I believe, like this. Oops, oh, give me that. There we go. Whew, okay, well. All right, pretty freaking good results. I'm gonna go to the monument, place it, and I'm gonna make myself an iron efficiency toothpick because it's about fucking time. I'm also gonna make myself some uh, some boots and a, uh, a better helmet, of course, because I need that shit, like badly. And I guess now is a good time as any to uh, show off my little railroad. So I'll let you guys, I guess, see that. Some parts of it are a little bit slow, but that's because we, um, that's because I don't, I don't have enough powered rails to keep, keep this up. So I had to use them a bit sparingly. Uh, it's faster on the way back, but when I'm going from intersection two to three, it's, uh, it's pretty slow in the beginning. Yeah, as you can see, I'm slowing down quite a bit. And for some reason, when I, de when I get off the minecart, I 
appear all the way here. That doesn't make any sense. I don't know why that is. But your guess is as good as mine. Yeah, I'm definitely going to be mining a whole bunch of iron off camera because I need that shit so badly. Uh, we'll make boots, we'll make better pants because, yeah, this shit is about to break. The skelly thing is okay. I'll, I'll replace that, I guess, off camera later. I don't know. Depends on how much iron we have left. Okay, so let's go ahead and boom, purple wool. Nice. So I'm guessing the other wool is cyan, I think, maybe. Um, hmm. Okay, let's go ahead and, oh yeah, I was cooking a bunch of these potatoes off camera, so that's why these are all filled up. Whole bunch of bone meal I had, that was really helpful. Um, right, let's get some coal. Why are you spawning? That doesn't make any sense. Uh, right. So let's go ahead and dump you and then dump you. Cool. Uh, iron pickaxe, right. Let's see here. Um, sticks. Do I have sticks? I can make some. Hold on, first I need to trash some of this stuff out of my inventory. Like all this junk I don't need. A uh, whole bunch of blocks. I need to uh, get rid of those. There you go. Four. So if we, if we do this, we can do something like that and then get efficiency on this and then we take this get efficiency one on that boom and then we can combine those to get four efficiency two so two here four there put those on um, right, so I need to make some more torches too, actually. I'm running a bit low on uh, coal, that's a bit concerning, but that's fine. So let's go ahead and dump these, that'll help me with more potatoes. Some more arrows there, and we can dump dump the iron here, and then we're good to go. Whoa, 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 actually, we're not good because I need to enchant this. Get that little bit of extra protection, you know. Yeah, these leggings are going to break any fucking second. I might have to degrade considerably can't risk that shit breaking in the middle of a fight do i have any fire resistance potions i feel like that would help me a lot um no i don't okay nice that's uh that's wonderful <laughs> Oh, this downgrade has brought me all the way to half armor, man. At least our boots won't break. Although it was probably a better investment to make better pants that would last rather than boots. Probably. Oh well, I, I, th I think we can beat it without 
having to worry about that. Yeah, you see it like slows down a lot over here, which is bad. If I could get some more powered rails, I could fix this. Put some more powered rails in between, you know. And then once it gets over here, it gets a it gets a bit faster. Yeah, I ran through like four or five stone pickaxes to mine through all that. I'd actually combine this with a sharpness one to get sharpness two, but that would just, uh, it would still take three hits to kill the mobs. Thank God this one doesn't spawn me outside and make me fall. You know how many times I fell trying to figure out how to uh, get that minecart thing to work properly for me? It took me a while. All right. Why are you guys, why do you guys keep spawning? I swear to God. Like, this shouldn't be happening. Yeah, we need to uh, patch some of these spots up. There you go. Excuse me, bitch? Uh, excuse me, motherfucker, but... Let's shoot that guy off. Shoot that guy off. Okay, first things first. Boop. I do not need you shooting me off. Uh, yeah, if I'm going to do this bridge, I need to... Oh, I see something over there. But I don't see any wolves. So I sh that means I probably should go this way. Just get rid of that guy right off the bat. Now, where was I digging? I was digging over here, right? Whatever, I don't know. All right, if I can get down. I think with the amount of blocks I have, I should be able to pretty reasonably build my little rails, right? Uh, oh, you guys are over here. Yeah, there's going to be quite a few mobs here. Not much you can do about that, but they're no big deal. All right. God damn. I need to shoot that witch if possible. Yeah, see, that's why. This is why. Right, so that takes care of that. Um, I have a whole bunch of coal here too. That's pretty useful, I'd say. Then again, we have some at the stalagmite thing too, so it's not a big deal. Oh man, we got so many blaze spawners. All right, let's go ahead and collect five, six, Seven, eight, nine. I would honestly just smelt it like right here, but can't do that. Okay. So let's go ahead and make our safety rails. 
We have plenty of blocks, so there's no need to worry. I'm doing this so the blaze can't knock me off and so that any skeletons can't knock me off. But I'm going to have to be super careful. Now, if I had fire resistance, this wouldn't be such a big problem. But the fact that I don't makes this... Yeah, see? Like right there. That skelly needs to... Yeah, if I had a fire resistance potion, this would be a lot less uh, nerve-wracking. I could just pop the blaze spawners as if they, uh, they didn't even spawn anything. As if I was in peaceful mode almost. It is per spinning pretty slowly, so I'm hoping that... Uh, although, at the speed I'm going... I don't want to get cocky. Like we do not want to get cocky here and and try to um or I guess more than cocky, we don't want to be yeah, see. We don't want to be reckless. One bad move and it's the end of us. Okay, let's go ahead and We can actually go ahead and just shoot these guys from here. Okay. Yeah, I need to be super, super careful. Whoops. Missing quite a few shots though. That's a bit uh, <laughs> worrisome, my skills. Whoops. There, shoot that guy. There, so that takes care of that guy. We have to remember there's a spawner on the top too, so. We'll have to deal with that one as well. Only concern is that I may run out of arrows. Oh shit. Okay, this is why we need to... Hmm. Yeah, I actually don't think that... Uh, I don't think trying to pop the spawners is a good idea here. I think it would be better for me to... It would be better for me to just... Uh, whatchamacallit... Alright, first off, let's... Yeah, we should probably just pillar up. So let's actually make ourselves a little hidey hole type of thing going here. Just so these guys can't shoot from above. This way they can't really see me, I think. Huh, too many of these guys are spawning though. It's turning into an issue. Hmm. Fuck, that's pretty bad. Alright, I might have to use the little despawn trick.
Yeah, I'm probably gonna have to use the despawn trick on these guys. The despawn trick meaning I just like run super far away and then they all despawn and then I come back. Probably have to use that trick. Okay, but in the meantime, I think it is a, uh, let's go over here and mine a whole bunch of this first off. We need, we need all the iron we can get right now. Need to badly restock. Yeah, see, like I said, this wouldn't be so bad if I had a fire resistance potion, but I don't. And I'm not going to keep shooting these guys because I don't want to run out of arrows. Yeah, they are super annoying. <sighs> you have to use strategy, man. I've learned not to be so impatient when I'm dealing with these kinds of things. It's always better to be too safe rather than too re reckless. The old me probably would have just gone for it without even building rails and just hoped that he didn't get knocked off and then I'd die. That's what the old me would do. But the more uh, experienced me knows better than to do that. But I guess in the meantime, we can go get the other wool. I think that's a good idea. All right, so once I get two stacks of iron, that should be good. Uh, 60, 61, 62, 63, and 64. Cool. So let's go ahead and climb back up this way. Hmm. Let's actually go over here. Whoa. Okay. Creeper. Let's just quickly get rid of you. Oops. Breaking blocks that I don't mean to is wasting my durability. Oh shit. Huh. Mayday. You know, if we could actually make ourselves like a notch apple if we wanted to, I feel like. If we wanted to, with all this gold, if we just grew an apple and stuff, we could do that pretty easily. Leather pants are gonna break soon. That's not good. But I need to light this place up, make sure that. Uh... Huh, where'd the other blaze go? Did they just despawn on their own? Okay, that's bullshit. That should not have hit me. I swear to God. Okay, oh, there's a chest here. What's this all about? There you go. 
right back guy. Split him up. Might as well make another torch. So, Power Miner 4000. What is this? <gasps> An iron pickaxe with fucking efficiency 10 and fortune 5? Dude, my fucking coal problems are solved. <laughs> Damn. That's a pretty good farming pick. Okay, I need to make sure there's no skeletons or other projectile, projectile uh, emitting monsters after me. Okay, we're gonna use the same trick. This one seems to be much less heavily guarded. Which is good. All right, just to make sure we don't get shot from behind, we'll do this. Just in case there's some skelly who decides to knock me off this way. Because you never know. You never know. Yeah, I freaking hate the void because if you, one misstep and you can fall right and your ass will drop right in and there's nothing you can do to save yourself. There. And yep, cyan wool achieved. All right, cool stuff. Put leave that there like that, just in case. Seems all the blaze have despawned. That's good. Wait, so what's over here? Oh, nothing. Worthless. All right, well, let's uh, let's go this way then. Whoa, not that way. I mean to go this way. Uh, we need to climb back up, however we do that. Not sure. So, okay, we go this way and then we're good to go. Need to make sure that uh, there aren't some stupid ass creepers coming after us. Oh, we got some more iron here. That's, that's cool. Okay, how did I get up here? I swear to God, man. How did I get up here? Whoa, whoa. Okay, I did not mean to do that. Well, there goes all my torches down there, but whatever. A needed sacrifice. That's the one thing about um, water falling into a place, though, is that... Is that uh, you have to build your way all the way up. You probably emerge somewhere you don't want to be. Okay, well, for, fortunately for us, nothing here to uh, kill us all. Okay. Uh, 51 arrow. Yeah, we're looking a bit rough here, Chief. Yo, 
You have got to be kidding me. Are you serious that there's actually a freaking... Oh my god. Okay. So we can technically just do that and then be over this way and then we come over like this and we layer ourselves that way. And then we can quickly come in here, Blade of the Dawn, what is this? Oh, oh. All right, let's get out of here. Bye bye. The conventional strategy would be to try to break the spawners first, but it's clearly not possible because those guys spawn way too fast. But we got the item uh, Sharpness 1, Fire Aspect 2, and Looting 3 on a diamond sword that's actually really freaking good if you ask me because um because now we don't have to worry about repairing every single time yeah it saves us a lot in the durability department I guess since we're here, we might as well mine a little bit more, replenish our supplies. Yeah. Title of this episode is going to be Nourishment. I think that's a good one. Uh, two and a half stacks is, I'd say, pretty good. I need to save some in case I need to, uh, you know. So we go like this, and then we go like that, and then we go over this way, and then we go like that, and then we jump like this, and then we go over here. Whoa, okay. And then we are good to go. Nice. Huh, <sighs> I really wanna know what's over on the other side of this bridge. I really do want to know. Huh. Whoops. Okay. Yeah, we're going to have to we have we're going to have to make some uh some safety rails to get over there next time. There's no way I'm crossing this bridge without one. That's just suicide. But we got the sign wool. Uh right. There is a hallway looking thing there, so I think that might be the next intersection, though I'm not positive on that. But regardless, this is a good episode. We got a lot done. We got a lot of uh, materials. Iron 2, this thing is actually about to break soon, so I have to repair that. Pants are gone, but that's okay, because now I can make my own. Uh, my protection two leggings, which will be pretty freaking helpful. It's like diamond protection one, basically. Uh, I can, I can get pro general protection two uh, iron helmet as well. That'll be pretty helpful. And uh, this thing is actually pretty freaking good, so I'm gonna leave this as is. Uh, gonna use my little miner efficiency ten miner nine thousand whatever. Actually, I could have used that thing to um, mine some mine some more iron. Fuck. But 
But now, but I actually have to see if uh, if I can repair this thing at all. Because if I can't, then I'm gonna have to uh, be pretty careful on how I use it. And if I do try to repair, it's probably gonna cost me a shitload of uh, experience, anyways. So I gotta use this with a. Uh, can't take this for granted, essentially. All right, but. Let's go ahead and throw you in there. Whoops. Throw you in there. Throw you in there. And then one, two, three, four. We'll get some iron cooking. Uh, cyan wool. Pretty, pretty stoked about that. Boom, there we go. So, so the next area is probably gonna be blue wool. Um, let's see here. So if I were to, let's see, I need to get an anvil first. Yeah, I can't repair this. It's too expensive. So I'm going to have to use this pretty sparingly. But, uh, actually, let me go ahead and do that real quick. Let me get some. Okay, first off, we need to get the, uh, the gold here. Get that and that. Uh, get some more coal going here. So we have 32 iron here, 32, 32, 32, 32. Perfect. So if we have one, two, three, four, like this, and then we have one, two, three, four, like that, and then we have one, two, three, four, and then one, two, three, four, like this. And we're good to go. Um, let's see. I need to throw more junk away. Uh, I don't need all this trash. Literally. Um, yeah, we'll do that. I want to. I want to test this thing out on a um, on a coal pillar. Let's see. Fuck, I probably should have brought some more food with me, but YOLO. <laughs> right? YOLO, might as well. Yeah, one of these things has like a giant coal tower thing, so... But this thing does have some pretty good unbreaking on it. Yeah, unbreaking 5. That's pretty freaking... Um... That's pretty good. Whoa. Whoa, almost killed me there, trash. Um, so, where is that coal spike? I need to find it. Mm, there it is. Coal spike has been found. Let's go ahead and see. So, need to dig some coal so I can get this coal. Nice! Four stacks already. Uh, let's see here. Boom, boom, boom. That is really satisfying, by the way. Holy God. Six stacks. I wonder, how did he make this coal tower thing anyways? Did he just... Okay, let's not get too carried away here. But I need to make sure that I get as much as I can because... Alright, let's get rid of all the places where... This is actually a really good source of experience too. Now that I think about it. If I need some EXP, I can just do this. Um...
Nice. That should be enough coal to last us the rest of the game, I hope. Might even just fill my inventory with coal, honestly. Just for safety measures. Once I can't fill my inventory anymore, then we'll, uh, we'll call it that. Yeah, in these, uh, in areas where there's, in maps where there's big areas, I run through coal super fast. Uh, even faster than I do in these maps because of how, uh, I guess, thorough I am with torching. Yeah, hopefully... I'm, I'm doing all this now because hopefully I won't have to ever do this again. Just make my life easy now. Um, yeah, we have so much coal. Uh-oh, we're lagging. Okay, we're lagging. I think there's uh, too much going on now. All right, I think that's good. I think that's, I think that's more than enough. I can actually use this sword to, uh, to loot these, uh, these zombies or not zombies, these skeletons. I can use it to loot them and, uh, get their, get their, get more, uh, get more, um, get more arrows. Cause I was running out of arrows because of all those blazes. I don't know why I'm lagging so much all of a sudden. This is very unexpected. Like, yeah, my computer is pretty fucking shit and it's overheating right now, but like, what did I do to make, make Minecraft lag out like this? I have no idea. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh-oh, and there's silverfish, okay. Fortunately, I don't think I have to ever come back here again, so... Okay, just please nobody knock me off, please. <laughs> don't knock me off and then we're good. Okay, whew. That marks the end of that. Yeah, I need to get some new armor ASAP. Wait a minute, where... Okay, I was about to see, where did all my experience levels go? I didn't see the numbers there. All right. So that's all the coal done. Uh, need to go over here and craft myself that gold block so we can put that on the monument. Uh, There we go. Look at all that coal, man. Look at that shit. Okay, all of these are done cooking. Need some of this, though. Should fill my saturation up quite a bit. And then we got the gold block. Let us... Dun, da, da, dun. Boom. And there's a zombie there that I do not like to see. I need to fill up all these. There we go. Not even gonna pick up that flesh. Doesn't mean anything to me anymore. But let's go ahead and collect our goodies. Nice. Two and a half stacks of nice freshly made iron so off camera I'm going to use all that iron and make a whole bunch of enchant enchanted protection to armor uh, repair this probably gonna replace these as well because um, is yeah because I mean stone tools are stone tools I mean might as well upgrade them at some point now that we have the iron to do so 
And um, yeah, next episode, we're going to con continue with the ravine. We're going to see what's on the other side of the bridge. Uh, and then after that, we'll, we'll, see, we'll see what happens from there. I don't think there's any more wolves, but there is a secret over there. So I need to go check that. But then after that, we'll probably go take on that uh, flat, flat water thing, whatever it's called, fresh water something. So uh, yeah, until then, guys, take care.